Yo, DXG game, what is good? Our notification game, what is good? Y'all already know who it is, man. It's your boy, Dynamic Skills, man. Coming at you guys with another NBA 2K20 video, man. Now, this video was highly requested by one of my boys in the stream. A perimeter lock with playmaking takeover, bro. An all-red pie chart. All-red defensive pie chart. 30 defensive badges with, with playmaking takeover. <laughs> yeah. Hey, this shit is crazy, bro. This shit is crazy, dog. Now, I, bro, I swear, bro. I remember when I was sitting here talking about this bill in my stream. Bro, everybody was like, man, Dynamic, what the fuck you gonna do with that, man? You can't shoot, bro. You Man, look, don't worry about that, bro. Listen to me, dog. I don't ride waves, bro. I create them, bro. You see what I'm saying? And, bro, this bill is golly. I, I dropped so many people off with this bill, bro. The shooting might be a little, you know, but look, you just got to surround yourself with the right teammate, dog, and you have to have IQ. I actually run the one with this build. It's, this shit is crazy. I run the one with this build, and I clamp up most of the guards, bro, that come across me. I'm telling you, bro, whether you want to make this build or not, and even I mean, you can even make this build just to, like, troll people and stuff, bro. The defense on this shit is, is crazy. Like, right now, currently, this gameplay that you guys are watching, my guys are 93 overall. But bro, when this motherfucker hits 99, oh, my God. I'm going to be a problem. I'm already a problem. I'm already causing havoc now. This shit's crazy. But, uh, yeah. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. All my day ones, all my loyals, man. Hit that like button right now. Give me a thumbs up on this video, bro. And let's go ahead and get into the stats, bro. All right, guys. For the physical pie chart, as you can see in the top right, you want to choose the one with the most speed, bro. Bro, 95 speed, 95 acceleration, 64 strength, 88 vertical. Listen to me. This is just the stats now. When I hit 99... This means I'm going to have a 99 speed, 99 acceleration. I'm going to have like a 90-something vertical. And I'm going to have almost a 70-something strength on a point guard. 6'5 point guard. All red pie chart. Which means you're going to be able to, bro, you're going to be able to lock shit up. You can, even, even, even after you get screened, you're going to be able to just catch up with your... Oh, my God, bro. This shit is so crazy. All right? But uh, let's get to the stats. Yeah, go go six five. Look, cause if you go six six, bro, your your speed and your acceleration is gonna drop completely. You don't want that. That's bad for business, especially as a guard, cause you're not gonna be able to keep up with those ninety nine play shots. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be real tough. The ninety nine playmakers. You know what I'm saying? All right. So I went six five. Now, as you can see, we have a seventy six close shot. 68 driving layup and an 80 driving dunk. Now, do you know what this means? This means at 99, I'll be able to have contact dunks, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'll have an 84 driving dunk at 99, which is going to allow me to have contact dunk. It's going to be crazy, bro. All right? Max out your mid-range. Max out your three. Max out your free throw. Max out your post fade. All right? That's going to give you three shooting badges, okay? Now, the mini... I don't even use quick draw on this build. I just use range extender on, on, on gold. Long as you can time it right, you'll be able to, in, anything inside the arc, you'll be able to green it. With the, the right jump shot, throw a little jump shot boost on. If you got a, a point guard that, that, that runs floor general and dimer on there, I'm telling you, bro, you're going you gonna to really go crazy, all right? 78 pass accuracy, 75 ball handle, all right? I'm not one of those guys who, you know, I'm not no dribble guy, nothing like that. I mean, I have, but I have, I have IQ, though. You see what I'm saying? So I don't really need all that, man. I, I go down court, do my little moves, you know what I'm saying? Do what I got to do. Find an open teammate or either, you know, go right past my defender. You see what I'm saying? All right. 6-5 will give you 73 interior defense, bro. Can you think about that as a guard? I hear a lot of y'all complaining about, oh, man, these damn hop steps are OP. Them slashers are OP. I'm going to tell y'all. I'm Look, I'm going to tell y'all why y'all get bodied by these slashers, bro. It's because you guys don't put no interior defense in y'all build as a guard. You think, oh, well, I don't, I don't, bro. You need it, bro. You need it, bro. Interior defense helps out so much. It's, it's I mean, now I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say it stops all of it, but, 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 bro, 
you will get some stops with your interior defense being up there. You know what I'm saying? So max that out, bro. Perimeter defense, max that out. Lateral quickness, max that out. Max out your steal. Max out your block. Max your defensive rebound. And don't touch the offensive rebound at all. You know what I'm saying? Those stats look amazing, bro. All right? So, 6'5". Now, for the weight, we're going to go 200 pounds. Don't want to be too light. Don't want to be too soft. But, you, you know what I'm saying? 6'5", 200 pounds with 65 strength, which means, which means at 99, I'll have like a 69 strength on a guard. I still have 99 speed. I think I'm going to end up finishing with 98 acceleration, which that still ain't bad. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to have a 90-something vertical. Bro, this, this shit's a dog, bro. It's like a Patrick Beverly, Ron Artest, Gary Payton type shit. Like, this, like this build is just, it's, it's going to be crazy. You know what I'm saying? Because, it, it, bro, if you think about all of these guards, like, they make a minimum weight. They have no strength, bro. You're going to be able to body everybody, bro. You're going to be able to body all of these guards, bro. And if somebody wants to help, you have you have the playmaking bag. You got your dimer to dish out to your shooters, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Listen, bro. It's just, it's just this build is, it feels crazy, man. Yeah, so go at 200, 65, 200 pounds, man. On the wingspan, leave the wingspan right where it is at default, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I said, you don't want to mess with your shooting. Like, right now, that 65 is going to turn into a 69 at 99, which means you're going to be able to shoot anywhere inside the perimeter. And with the right point guard and with the right teammates, bro, I got. I mean, like I said, if you have a, a two guard or something that has, you know, Hall of Fame floor general or Hall, and Hall of Fame dimer, you're going to be able to shoot. I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say you'll be able to shoot consistently, but you are going to be able to shoot, bro. But that's not why we made this build for shooting. If I wanted to make a shooting build, I would have made one. I made this build strictly for the defense, bro, because I know it's gonna cause havoc. It's gonna piss a lot of people off, and you're gonna lock a lot of shit up, dog. And that's exactly why I made this build. Create your own wave, y'all. Y'all stop following trends, bro. Real nigga shit. All right, so yeah, uh, default wingspan, man. Now, as you can see right here, lock down. Or playmaker takeover. Listen, I could choose the lockdown takeover, but listen, I am a team player. If you guys did not know, play me, I, to me, the playmaking badge is probably one of the most OP badges in the game. You you get a boost to your speed. You get a, a, a boost to your timer. You get a boost to all your playmaking. Your teammates have a higher chance of hitting the shots once you have that badge. Sometimes when I pass to my teammate, bro, 90% of the time, they don't miss when I got my badge on. It's really effective. And you'll be able to snatch ankles, bro, on a perimeter lockdown. You'll be able to snatch ankles on a perimeter all red pie chart lockdown. It's so funny. Shit is crazy. All right, so let's go ahead and do with that. And there you go right there, man. You know what I'm saying? You got a perimeter lockdown. With playmaking takeover. It's crazy. This shit's OP, dog. All right, so here we go for the uh, for the badges. You know, we got two finishing badges, three shooting badges, eight playmaking, and 30 defense. Like I said, bro, this ain't the best shooting build. This ain't the best dribble guy build. I'm just, bro, this build can be good, bro. This build is good, bro. I'm telling you right now. It's, it just, it has to be in the right hands, though, bro. It has to be in the right hands, and you have to surround yourself with good teammates, bro. All right, but here we go. For my finishing, I'm gonna go contact finisher silver, okay? Contact finisher silver, you gotta have contact so I can get to the rim effectively. You see what I'm saying? All right, now on my shooting. Right now, I only have two shooting badges on my build. All right, so I, right, right now, all I have is range extender and I'm greening just fine. So I might do range extender. You can do range extender, catch and shoot. You can do range extender and quick draw. I mean, really not too much you can do. But like I said, we didn't make this build for for shooting. We made this build for defense. You know what I'm saying? So let's just say I do rain extender silver and catch a shoot bronze. You know what I'm saying? Anything in the mid-range with this right here, you'll be able to cash out any fucking mini, bro. With this shit. All right? Now, for my playmaking, what I have now, I have dimer on gold. Because like I said, I am a pass first guard. I love setting my teammates up. So if I have a badge to help my teammates score... This is the one right here, all right? Dimer gold. Put handles for days for on silver. I'm not really no dripper god or, or anything like that. I like to go down court, do do a couple moves, see if I can get past my defender or 
you know, try to get my teammates open. You know what I'm saying? Quick first step, go, man. Because I'm telling you right now, a lot of people, this quick first step, bro, I get a lot of people all the time. And you get the ball, bam, pump fake, and I'm going. After the pump fake, with that speed, you're going to be able to go by him every time unless you're playing a really good defender. You know what I'm saying? Now, for the bread and the motherfucking butter, y'all. Look at this shit, bro. 30 defensive badges. Now, you can, you, bro, you can, you can do whatever. You can do whatever. You can go clamps, defensive leader, intimidator Hall of Fame, pick dodger Hall of Fame, pickpocket Hall of Fame, rim protector. You're going to have an 80-something rebound, so you can put rebound chaser on there. Oh, my God, bro. It's just so much you can do with this, man. I mean, I can't wait till I get it maxed out. I got uh, 16 badges out of 30. When I get it maxed out, I will definitely show you guys some gameplay. But, man, this build is crazy on the defensive end. And I'm really, really close to hitting Legend. So, when I hit Legend, can you imagine me with 40 defensive badges, bro? When I hit, All right, look. Check this out. Listen. When I hit Legend, bro, I'm going to have 40 defensive badges. I'm going to have 18 playmaking. I'm going to have 13 shooting. And I'm going to have 12 finishing. With playmaking takeover. This shit's going to be crazy. It's going to be OP, bro. But, uh, yeah, man. This is my perimeter lockdown build with playmaking takeover, bro. If you guys decide on making this, man, let me know. Let me know if you like it, man. Give me some gameplay with it, bro. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, leave a like on the video, man. But, yeah, this is my perimeter lockdown build with playmaking takeover, man. Just try it out. Try it out, bro. This shit gonna be OP, bro. But uh, it's your boy down there, Skills, signing out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Leave a like on the video. Show your boy some love. Share the video, bro. Share the video. You never know who's watching, bro. And it's your boy down there, Skills, man, signing out, bro. I'm gone. Peace.